and there's one weapon that's three diamonds. So if I just take a seat. Oh wait, no. One six, which is the G3KA4. And then the other two are four diamonds each. Forgot. I always end up buying the ones that I started with, which is the G3KA4 and the pistol. And then I'll get the shotgun eventually. It's only four diamonds worth anyway. But we can also get manuals, which increase, like as you can see, their accuracy, their reliability, and I'm sure that's it. And the repair upgrade, which is for the uh, vehicles. But the repair upgrade is only... It just means that you repair them quicker, I think. And then you can get like upgrades for like your ammo and how many serrets you can carry, as well as the storage, which is pretty cool. The stealth suit is pretty cool. I don't actually know how well it works. I didn't buy anything. I need to buy things. I might just buy two primary weapons. Because I've got the pistol that can take over from the... Um, I've got a shotgun that can take over from the pistol. Once a weapon is purchased, you'll find unlimited quantities available in the armory next door. Purchased weapons are always in perfect condition. Hooray! And I really want to find a weapon that's got shitty quality. Right now what we need to do is go into the armory and switch our weapon out. And I'm going to just switch it out and use these. Take one of those, take one of those. And finally take one of those. Yay! Now we have three awesome weapons. The only thing that annoyed me with the fortunes pack is the fact you get three, no not three, you get two shotguns. Like you've got the secondary one which is this. It looks pretty badass uh, just in design. Uh, that's an incredibly high powered. You've got this which is silenced which is pretty cool but it's also a shotgun. And then you've got the explosive crossbow which is if no like it's not really related. <laughs> it's just explosive. And incredibly potent. Hey, it's me. Name's Marty I know. Get your ass over here, stat. Sup, bruh. Your first and best buddy. This buddy will contact you during missions to offer alter alternate blah, 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 alternate ways to complete missions. As your reward, you'll increase your reputation and upgrade your safe house. So long time no see. How's that malaria treating you? Shit. That guy? He's got the malaria pills. He'll help you. Oh, hey. If you ever need some help, you know, you just let me know. We're buds. Oh, he gave me a little smile. That's nice. Hello. Oh. oh. Blood tip, all right? That's it. That's all I've got. What? Well, aren't you going to destroy it? That's what your friends usually do. Wait, you're not here for the tapes, are you? No. Nope. Oh, I see the problem now. You can get the pills you need from the church in Pala. The priest there will help you, assuming you make it in time. Just passes along for me. Okay. You can't break a man the I love this tape. Or a horse. The harder you beat a man, the, the taller he stands. I'm, one of them. I'm Ruben Oluagendi, what you call a stringer. And you are new, I can tell by the state of your clothes. You're much <laughs> too clean. You're taking a chance talking to me. I'm persona non grata around here. The warlords want me out of the country. They don't like the story I'm writing. It's okay. About the war. And about them, of course. But mostly it's about the famous arms dealer, the Jaka. Oh. Him on the tape. Do you know I have covered 16 wars across Africa? 16. And every time he has been there, selling his weapons and making a fortune while millions of people suffer and die. <laughs> he thinks he can continue to do his work in secret. But it's hardly a secret. These stories, they are going to come out. The Jackas, the warlords, the soldiers, the, the Jackas, soldiers, even the NGOs. I intend to expose the whole sordid mess. I make it sound very dramatic. We'll see if anybody back home even notices. Hmm. <laughs> I just noticed Marty Allen cars on this board. There he is. Look at little Marty. And that isn't Paul. I don't think. Looks like an early Vass. <laughs> it actually does. So, here's this new guy. Who are you? You're Russian. I don't know if his name is Yosef. I'm Yosef. Oh, it is. Yosef. Even tough guys need help sometimes. 
Okay. Alrighty. Well, thank you, Yosdeep. I'll see you later. Uh, what am I doing? I've been interviewing people for months now. Diplomats. Oh fuck! I don't care. Let me leave. <laughs> he knows I'm not listening, so he just yells at me instead. I meant what I said. Please listen to me. Oh yeah, while I drive to Pala, hopefully I can do this, I'm going to listen to the Jackal tape. You can't break a man the way you break a dog or a horse. Oh yeah. Execute the wounded. Burn them. <laughs> Close combat. Destroy the preconceptions of what a man is, and you become their personal monster. Jesus. When they fear you, you become stronger. You become better. Let's never forget. It's a display. It's a posture, like a lion's roar or a gorilla thumping at his chest. If you lose yourself in the display, if you succumb to the horror, then you become the monster. You become reduced. Not more than a man, but less. And it can be fatal. Jesus Christ. I do absolutely love that tape, and it is an incredibly good quote, but holy crap the Jackal talks a lot. <laughs> like what the hell bro? Calm your titties. Oh I can actually get diamonds now can't I? There's diamonds right next to this car here. Bada boom bada bing. Hell yeah. Well, I nearly have enough diamonds to get the Makarov anyway. Bloody hell. Alright. So... There's some diamonds over here. Town is under ceasefire, that means you can't shoot at anyone or they'll shoot at you. Check your map for the limits of the ceasefire zone. This part, to get the diamonds, is very, very straightforward. You walk up to it. Even in a ceasefire zone, faction troops will open fire if you trespass into restricted zones. You've been warned. Done. Ta-da! Hello. See, I'm not even in the that, that zone. I might as well go and get the other one as well, hadn't I? Yeah, may as well. I don't think they open fire at you straight away. They tell you to fuck off, and then they'll open fire. If you don't fuck off. Here's the other one. I don't see anybody. Okay. Take. Yay, I win. Slide. Yeah. Is there even any work, like point to getting into that? I guess so. Beats running. Not by much. The malaria in this game, it's a good feature, but it can get very, very... I wouldn't say annoying, but more so... Uh, I don't really know the word. It can be very awkwardly put. Like you could be in the middle of a massive firefight and then you'll have a malaria attack. And you can't do anything, you have to take the medication or you'll pass out. I'm sorry, there aren't regular services at the moment. I'm after medicine. Oh, you're not well. You should see a doctor before you really need a priest. <laughs> Did Ruben send you? He had something for me. I would be very happy to give you what little medicine I have in exchange. I'll give it. I think you should take one of those right away. That is exactly what I'm gonna do. Take the medicine. Ding! I don't know how many pills you actually have. Those will only last a short while, but I may know where to get more. Not all of my people have left. Many are trapped, scared of what will happen if they are caught trying to leave. Right. Others who have chosen to stay. We try to help where we can, and we could use someone like you. Well, that's good. 
I'll help when possible. Oh, I will, buddy. I will. Alright. Training section finished. The tutorial and training elements are now finished. Walton Purefoy can introduce you to Prosper Kuasi at the API headquarters marked with an exclamation point. The pills will keep your malaria in check. For now, you are free to explore the world. Safe houses can be unlocked and upgraded by working with buddies. Guard posts can be scouted for intel. Diamonds can be found through exploration. Diamonds can be used to purchase weapons that you unlock by taking side missions. Other side missions for diamonds, arms or reputation can be found at any location marked with a exclamation point and you can travel from the bus stations. Yeah, we know about the... And then that last part was pretty much just telling us about the jackal. Out there, there is a guy called the jackal. What do you want? He is arming the the war. Well, that dude's phone was like dial tone. He couldn't get through to his buddy. Oh no! I don't really know where to go first now. Now that I'm free! Uh, I think I'll just go to Mike's bar. Fuck it. Might as well. Alright. I don't like how that arrow on the thing changes to red and it's saying I should go to Pala. That's only if I want to do the story mission, which I don't. Not yet, anyway. I want to do all the side missions first. As in, like, side missions I'm able to do. <laughs> One of each is what I did last time and then I ended the session, because that actually took a fair while. So, I think that's what I'll- oops. I think that's what I'll do again. I think because we started at Lumber, we can go back there freely without getting shot. I'm pretty sure. I'm hoping so. If not, then that kind of blows. Right, we'll do the weapon convoy first. Hola! When there is no mission activated, the arms vendor will appear at the weapon shop. He can offer you missions to unlock new weapons for purchase. Your next mission will unlock the following. A Star 45 flare pistol and a silent Makarov. Hey friend, how about some side work today? Sure thing, buddy. Is You're out, Sorry, I moved a tiny bit further. Too bad. To move in on my business. He's got a shipment coming in. Bad product, none of it clean. You take out that convoy, and I'll bring in some special inventory for you. All right. I love that enterprising spirit, my friend. Yeah, it's fine. I got weapons, so I don't care. Where is this dude at? What the heck? He's in the bottom. He is in the ass end of nowhere. Oh my. They always tend to put you, or put the missions, as far as way, as far away as they possibly can. Although this one is right next to a bus station, so that's pretty cool. I'd say that's the only good thing about it. So, just have to make our way. Oh dear. No, my van. Van, my jeep. It's smoking. I don't need to fix it though because I'll be back well I'll be at the bus station very very shortly and then I'll be gone to the bottom left of the map which is something I need to remember oh is this the let about the letters yep Okay. I actually cut that off the last time they were talking to me because I didn't know that why made you hang up on them. But apparently it does. Which is great. <laughs> I'm sick. Malaria. The Jackal's very resourceful, I'd say. He managed to track us down to our hotel. So he's very, very, he's either very smart or he's got contacts. He's most probably got contacts. Oh dear. I don't know why I'm yawning. It's 12. In the afternoon. So, not even late. Met Father Melaya. I don't want to save. I don't know where they are though. They're behind me. <gasps> no. 
there's also a house like right there. Awesome. Oh yeah, because I have the the watch watch call it the crossbow. <laughs> 